EarthCast operates four sensors in space. Two of those sensors, or cameras, are operated from the International Space Station. Those cameras were installed in early 2014, and they include a full-color, full-motion video camera and a still image camera, both of which are capable of taking images of the Earth's surface from 400 kilometers up. The video camera on the ISS will shoot as many as uh, 20 cities a year. Some of the more interesting locations that we've taken imagery of are in North Korea, in Pyongyang, the capital, as well as uh, at the refugee camps along the Syrian-Jordanian border. And even in uh, Mosul, in Iraq, the oil field fires that are going on over there in, in the midst of that war with ISIS. The story in Pyongyang is very interesting in that we look at this beautiful infrastructure, uh, quite well built out, but there's very few cars on the highway, and there's very few people out and about. And it starts to raise uh, new ideas and new understanding and certainly a lot of questions about life in Pyongyang. EarthCast does respond to uh, requests from the UN for imagery over uh, disaster areas, whether it's an earthquake in uh, Italy as recently as happened, or a flood. Those images are obviously turned into maps that are then used by the first responders. We have the opportunity to take a look at scenes and locations like that and tell a story. And the story is that there is life that is happening, there is conflict that is happening, there is good and bad all around the world, and we give a view of that from space that can help inform the public, that can help inform decision makers and policy makers, and we can confirm uh, truth by looking at things from space that might otherwise be uh, distorted through other channels.